as an indigenous population, we have shared and celebrated our engagement with non-indigenous populations. The time has come now, I believe, to be able to co-create an agenda for the well-being of our respective communities, recognising that both add value to our nationality. For New Zealand, that's one perspective. For Brazil, I would argue it is exactly the same, despite where that continuum may be. A great opportunity um, for New Zealand to share a little bit of its experience in, in, in the Indigenous language area in New Zealand. Um, the, the presenters did a great job. The, the stories were fantastic and, and really personal as well. And, but something that really stood out for me is that even though we've made a lot of advances in New Zealand in recent years, the, the fight still goes on. Um, there's still a lot to do in New Zealand and I think it's important that we keep working together um, to promote and to protect the, Maori, the use of the, the Maori language, te reo Maori, in New Zealand. Um, I think the biggest point for me is that we are all agents of change and uh, around the preservation and revitalisation of our indigenous languages, every one of us is an agent of change and so I think if we take that away, um, for me that would be the message that I would want to leave.